And um, no, really, I just want to. I this really was a surprise. To me. Um, and so you know, to, to have this award, it actually um, it, it means a lot to me. But at the same time, though, as as was mentioned earlier, there's a lot of people behind the scenes that has made this possible and has made a dream of mine become a reality. I actually on the way over here, I had to make a quick stop because I've got probably 20, there's probably 20, 25 members right now at the new library setting up with study halls and music and food and all kinds of stuff for our players and everybody to come and enjoy Christmas and 5 to 30 to 7 to 30 to drop in and so to be able to walk in and see things set up and things ready to go and knowing that there's a good group of volunteers that are making other people who are less fortunate, you know, to have the opportunity to become and, and just be able to be, you know, like normal. Just, you know, and that's the thing about it. It's all the fire department, the mayor, all down with part with the government. A big portion of them are our players. And, um, and just to see the smiles on her face, you know, I, it's like I always say, you have a bad day, um, come to a Miracle League game, and I guarantee you're going to realize your bad day is not really a bad day. And um, so it's, um, it, it's one of those things, and the community, the support towards everybody else. So if anybody knows me, I can stand up here for hours and talk. <laughs> we got to get back to business, I guess. Thank y'all.